Hello you and you and you welcome to my channel in today's video I'll be showing how to fluff out spring twist air and I know you could be like really why is she making a video on that okay the truth is this with spring twist air you have to do this carefully I mean if you've been doing spring twist or if it's a style you do often you know that the air is very very tricky especially when you buying the air from Amazon every bundle you get could be different trust me I've got stories for days sometimes the air could come really soft and um, it can it can come really soft and silky and uh, fluffing it out is an easy breeze while sometimes it could just be easily be a nightmare to fluff out and uh, pulling the air apart is just like a thug of war the honest truth is that spring twist air is prone to tangling that's why you have to be careful and patient while fluffing it another thing with the style is that you cannot cheat the process by using a pre-fluffed um pre-fluffed um, spring twist air now you will not get the same results a few brands now make pre-fluffed um, spring twist air but when you use them your twists they will be super uniform and they won't be like crinkled fluffy you know spring you know the way you like spring twist air um spring twist looking like you know just interesting kinky looking especially when you're going for the smaller size um, twist so in my opinion your best bet is just to go for good old spring twist here take your time fluff them out gently and i promise you you will love the outcome of your style and at this point i'm just gonna stop talking and let you enjoy the video As you can see, I start separating the air from the middle. That's about the only right way to get this done correctly. Start separating from the middle, then you um, ease your way gently towards one end. And once you've got one side fully fluffed out, you go back to the other side and get it done. Never, ever, ever start from the end. That's just going to make the air like tangled. And sometimes you have to like unwind it. Like, see, it's like I'm flipping it backwards and just run your fingers through and it just comes apart. Then depending on the size of the twist, you're you're doing like this particular one I'm doing now I'll be splitting each piece of air in three like yep one two three splitting three now each spring twist is now giving me three twists so that's it 